Hello everyone, in this video we will discuss about the cookie and web cache proxy server. In cookie, as we discussed earlier, the HTTP server is a stateless, means HTTP is stateless protocol. It doesn't maintain any of the past record of the client request. So, the server can handle day by day thousands of the client requests. So, we need to store the user preference or user track activity. For that, we need a cookie. Cookie is a small text file that is stored in the user computer. Either it will be temporary or it will be permanently stored on user's hard disk. Cookie provide a way for the website to recognize you means it keep a track record or activity of your preference of visited website by you in their computer hard drive. Let us understand the, how cookie works in this animation. Cookie is a small text file which is stored in your hard drive, user's computer. When you are visiting any of the website and choose the language preference as a English rather than other language. So that website set a cookie means stored cookie in your hard drive as a English like lang English language preference. After some time again visit the same website it set English website by default because cookie is already set as a English language. Now as well as language, timestamp and like, dislike, users activity, shopping preference and viewed link reference stored in as a cookie. Let's see another things. If you visit same website then your preference is set as a English but the different website the first time you visit different website your preference will not set as English because you are first time visited that different website. Now after stored in cookie it set a ID number on server database. So based on the ID the server know the preference. Let's see the example. When I will visit a visit a news website. In news website there is some portion for the advertisement of different site. So which content display over here? The content displayed over here is visited website by your computer. If you visit any of the shopping website or any health website or any entertainment website, so their content stored as a cookie in your drive. It will display on this particular site. Let us see real example. You are facing same situation in day by day life. If you are visiting Amazon website for buying shoes. After some time you are visiting any health regarding website. Then onwards you visit news website. In news website in this portion it display either Amazon shoes content or medicine regarding content or any of the visited website which you visit earlier. So it is come from the cookies which is stored in your computer. So cookie can contain four part. We can say cookie has four component. First a cookie header line in HTTP response message. So in HTTP response message, the cookie header line included. As well as HTTP request message, it also included a cookie header in HTTP request message. Third one is cookie file kept on the user end system and managed by the user browser. Fourth one is a backend database at website server. So it store a cookie ID. Now what the use of the cookie? 
it is used for the authorization of the end user's identification recommendation means you set a preference of the any of the languages in particular website shopping cart items session details about email or any of the website now let's take an example here in this figure the client server and backend database of web server now client visited a website shopping website ebay so the ebay cookie stored in client computer and id of the ebay cookie is 8734 after some time client visited first time second shopping website it is a amazon so first time it visited amazon website the client make a connection and then send a http request message to the server amazon server and it create a cookie id 1678 for the user and that cookie id entry stored in the database of server now amazon server reply response object page with cookie id 1678 to the client side client browser stored amazon website cookies id 1678 after some time or second time client send again a request for the same amazon web page see the http request message from the client for the cookie means same web page amazon the cookie is 1678 it not create another cookie because you already visited same website so the server received reference id 1678 from the database and reply the response message to the client after one week again i want to access same website amazon so in this example it will create cookie again or not no it not create again cookie id because it already stored previously on this backend database let's see client send a http request message with cookie id 1678 which is stored earlier and the server reply that cookie id with response message to the client 